Halo, selamat datang di Musik Player Collection. Terima kasih telah mengeklik video ini. Ada apa di hari ini? Ada video dari Cakrakan ya. Masih di Cakrakan ya. Dan kali ini saya akan menampilkan reaktor yang baru lagi. Hehe. Ada baru lagi, Bro. Sikat yuk. Dan reaktor ini bernama uh, bernama Tania Levi. Tania Levi adalah seorang pelatih vokal, pelatih vokal dan juga seorang penyanyi ya. Ini berasal dari Jerman ya. Kalau nggak salah saya lihat di channel YouTube-nya dia ada di Jerman, channel orang Jerman. Jadi jika kalian penasaran nanti saya akan tautkan linknya di kolom deskripsi ya. Kalian bisa langsung ngecek kebenarannya. Oke? Okay? Dan ini Tania Levi ini baru sekali mereaction video catakannya dan baru juga saya menampilkan di kolom di channel ini. Oke, okay, ini akan sangat seru karena ini sangat memumpuni dalam bidang tarik suara. Tentunya akan menjadi sebuah pelajaran baru, pengetahuan baru. Oke, okay, daripada panjang lebar, langsung saja kita menuju videonya. Go. Hello my beautiful friends and welcome back to my channel. So today we are reacting to a hidden gem from Indonesia. We have a playlist here with Indonesian reaction and singers. So if you want to see me reacting to your talents from Indonesia, then please head over okay. to the end of the video and then you see me reacting to your stars from Indonesia. So let's go straight into the video. Let's go. Simon is never impressed. And the world that fire from the sky To refile the beauties of King Wow. Let's make one stop here. So, beautiful voice, distorted sound, rocky okay. sound, very beautiful low larynx there. You have that soul and that distorted sound, that, that rocky sound. If you are singing with distorted sound, really make sure where it comes from, yeah? It comes always from your false vocal folds and it comes from, from your epiglottis, from that part here. That's the reason. And um, there are several muscles in your larynx that produce that distorted sound. Usually a voice by nature is never, never, never a raspy. It can get raspy because of multiple yeah. things. Yet like your lifestyle, smoking, drinking, wrong technique, breathing problems, um, problems in, with your jaw muscles, um, bones. So there are different uh, things that can, can, can lead to your voice sounding uh, distorted. But by nature, it's not the case. I just made a, a, a master class okay. with this, so it's very interesting. Simon is never impressed. Even though I know this fire brings me pain, even so, beautiful. A stop? Why is he stopping? Okay. I think you have a great voice. Uh, I didn't like the track, though. So. Uh. Okay, so um, they changed the song. Ah, that's terrible. It must be such a terrible feeling being on stage and then all of a sudden they want you to change the song. I had a student that was entering a competition here in Germany, which was German Idol. I guess you all know the, the, the idol, yeah, the American idol, the German idol, Indonesian idol, and they changed her key. So last minute she was in front of the judges and it wasn't te yeah. on television. And then they said to her, we want you to sing that song in original key. And thank God we practiced the lower key version that we gave her and the higher key version. So she managed to do the higher key version. It was not completely perfect. Some notes were flat because of, you know, it's such a nervous situation and stuff like this suddenly go for original key even though you haven't practiced it um like the like yeah. the lower one it was it was tough but she went through it and she went into the top 10 of german idol by the way yeah but it's nerve-wracking oh dear 
Did you bring another song with you? He's holding yes. on for dear life okay, on this microphone. Great. Let's do it. Like he's like he's I grew like up this. with Bob Marley, and my lad father used to play this song all the time before mm -hmm. I go to school. So uh, there's no woman no cry. No woman no cry. Okay. Let's see. No woman no cry. Then I remember when we used to say in a government church in Chinatown. Over over serving the hypocrite. Mm. We with the good people. I'll be quite honest with you. I mean, the judges don't seem quite impressed. Obviously, yeah. this is a job where they see a lot of talented people. After a while of watching a lot of talents, uh, how do you say it in English? You know, you get used to a lot of talents. I, I had the same feeling with, with the pe people in the music industry that I'm working and the singers I'm working here uh, locally or online. They are very, very skilled already. They come in very skilled. And uh, so after a while, it's hard. You have to look at the emotions in the song or you have to listen mm. to the singer the technique so what is it that makes you special and unique at some point and here i think those guys you know i think it could have had some tones that would be a little bit more gentle or softer i'm missing some softer notes it's a lot of belting it's a lot of loudness it's a lot of distortion i think the emotions so far hmm okay. let's continue So dry your tears, I say If you know the words, sing with me No woman will cry No woman will <laughs> sing along. Yeah. yeah, just a small okay. stop. Well, I think it was very well sung. It was very well sung. I feel just that he was smiling a lot, which is con con uh, con a contradiction to what he is singing. Yeah. And I feel, you know, I feel it could be more emotional. After a while, when you sing a song over and over again, sometimes the singer loses the connection to the song and then he has to reinvent the song and he has to go again into the okay. musicality of the song because he was very loud for very little piano. There was very little instrument instruments in the back. Now, at some point, you have to get rid of your head and your technicality and listen to what is displayed in the song in the musicality, yeah, in the notes, because the notes of the song were much more Pianissimo was not so, he could have also go into head voice, for example, you know, if you want to sing that song. So I think I would have yeah. liked a little bit more dynamic. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it's a show after all. And because I, I do work over 10 years in the music industry and we have a lot of candidates that are in those shows, like The Voice of Germany. We also had the winner here of The Voice of Germany that is from Indonesia, Claudia Santoso. So if you want to see our video together, our coaching session, then, you know, um, just just wait a little bit till this video is over, right? I think those shows are very difficult because most of the time the shows are quite rigged. They have their own schedule, they have their own systems. It's quite manipulative, so the audience is not really deciding this. It's, I think it's difficult. It's a TV show and it's about entertainment. It's not really about the artist or about his skills. It's an entertainment okay. show. And I think you never can forget this. It's all about the show. And the show brings money, you know, and you have to have pe pe uh, public view and you have to have people view the show. 
This is important, more important than the artist, the singer, the people that come into the show. Let me know in the comment sections what you think. Did you like the performance? I would have loved to see him with a complete different song. I think both songs were okay, but I would love, like to see him with a with a different song, you know, more maybe a more rocky or you know, a little bit longer also. This is the video where you can see me and Claudia have our coaching sessions. And here is the playlist to our Indonesian okay. reaction yeah. videos. Hashtag weaponize your voice, get strong and kick ass. Oke okay, sobat itu demikianlah reaksi dari guru cantik asal Jerman ya yang mereaksi cakrakan saat di American Hotel saat audisi kemarin ya dan di sini banyak banget eh, pengetahuan baru pembelajaran baru dari guru ini ya karena dia juga membuka ruang kelas orang Indonesia pun ada katanya dan kita bisa ngecek nanti di channel YouTube-nya ya katanya ada orang Indonesia yang memang masuk dalam kelasnya dan masuk juga ikut peserta di Jerman Aul Idola Jerman Idol maksud saya seperti Indonesia Idol, American Idol dan ini Jerman Idol ada Claudia namanya katanya kita bisa cek nanti dan sepertinya ini guru ini memang sudah memumpuni banget ya sudah sangat berpengalaman banget untuk memegang suara ya memegang jenis-jenis suara dia sangat detail yang saya perhatikan di sini dia sangat detail untuk menerjemahkan semuanya apa yang terjadi sebenarnya di acara televisi dan <tuh> untuk suara cakrakan memang tergolong sangat bagus dan unik tapi memang dengan lagu dengan lagu No Man ini memang apa ya tidak menonjolkan uh, sesuatu yang wow yang berada karena lagu ini saya sudah bilang berkali-kali kemarin lagu No Woman No Cry ini lagu yang sangat sederhana banget ya nggak ada yang menonjol ya itu karena cakrakan terpaksa membawakan lagu ini karena lagu yang diandalkan lagu yang disiapkan dari rumah dari Indonesia udah berbulan-bulan disiapkan dengan matang ternyata di stop oleh juri yang bernama Simon Simon ya Simon Simon <laughs> Oke okay, kalau saya orang Indonesia ngomongnya Simon aja ya daripada Simon nanti dikira merek HP Oke okay? seperti itu ya jadi udah dihapa disiap-siapkan matang dari Indonesia ya untuk membawakan lagu Nek Iterang itu dan ternyata baru setengah lagu udah di stop hingga akhirnya terpaksalah lagu cadangan itu karena setiap orang yang ikut audisi pasti akan menyiapkan lagu-lagu cadangan. Ya. Terima kasih kalian semuanya yang sudah mengaklik video ini sampai habis. Semoga kalian sehat selalu, panjang umur dan dilimpahkan rezekinya. Sampai jumpa kita di video berikutnya. Bye.